Hey, what is going on guys? It's your boy Keith here. For today's video, I'm just going to go ahead and play some Battlefield 4. And to be honest with you guys, I haven't played Battlefield 4 in a couple days now. Because for some reason, every time I search, it either crashes or it just doesn't put me in a game. And I know the fucking PlayStation fanboys would be like, uh, Xbox One sucks. But uh, I looked it up online. It's happening on PC. It's happening on PlayStation 4. It's basically just a Battlefield 4 issue. So I'm hoping today it works. I haven't played Battlefield in a couple days now, and I really want to play, so I'm just going to get right into it and start searching, and I'm just basically going to do a live com. Hopefully, it works. Actually, let me unplug my connector quick. Uh, where's the plug? Connects unplugged. The only reason I did that is because I'm doing a live com, and with the connect, people are going to be able to hear me and shit, so it'll be really annoying if people heard me while I was trying to talk. Ah, Alright, let's go. So basically, I've been really inactive lately on this channel, and on YouTube in general. I mean, I've only been uploading to my main channel fucking every other day lately, and it's just... I don't know. I don't really know why. <laughs> but, um, I've been playing, like, Battlefield for a day, or I try, and it doesn't work, but. And then I'll go to Call of Duty for a day, and then I'll go play Forza for a day, and it's kind of affecting the way I game. Like, I ain't, instead of, like, being good at every game, I'm starting to just suck at every game. And I don't know. I feel like I almost have to just pick a game and stay with it. And the reason it's like that is because, like, Call of Duty Ghosts, you can run and gun. And what I mean by that is you can just run around and just kill people everywhere. And, you know, you don't have to... You don't necessarily have to camp in that game. This game, if you run out in the open, you're dead. Like, you know, it's not really... This game isn't gun skill based. I mean, obviously there's a certain amount of gun skill required in the game, but... It's not like Call of Duty. You can rely more on explosives in this game, more on army tanks and helicopters and... And there's no stalker in this game, which I hate, so I can't really aim down the sights. But, I mean, you guys already know overall, I think this game is better than Call of Duty Ghost, though. Like, Call of Duty Ghost, I don't know, like I said, for a next-gen game, they did not step it up. I feel like Battlefield 4 with the 32 vs. 32, or even the 16 vs. 16, that's what I'm playing right now, is 16 vs. 16. And this is, like, you know, next-gen quality. Call of Duty Ghost, nothing really changed. Alright, so he's way over there. I'm gonna try to. Wow, that dude threw a perfect grenade. <laughs> I was gonna try to fucking new tube that guy across the map, but. I guess it wasn't gonna happen. Wait a minute. See, this is the, one of the problems with Battlefield. I searched Rush, and I just realized that I'm not playing Rush. This is Team Deathmatch, maybe? Like, I don't know what it is with Battlefield. Like, I feel like they, I don't know, they didn't finish fixing everything before they released it. Like, if you go watch bigger YouTubers that play Battlefield, which is something I've been doing lately, I've been keeping my eye on, like, you know, YouTube YouTubers that play Battlefield, because I'm trying to get better at it, and I'm trying to find people to join the clan that are better at Battlefield, but, uh, if you go watch anybody who knows anything about Battlefield, all you see is them complaining about how bad it is. If you ask me, it's like a beautiful game. But, you know, I didn't play the other ones, and it does seem to have a lot of fucking bugs. No, he's countering me. Oh, I got him. I mean, it does have a lot of bugs, but, I mean, there's a lot going on in this game. But, I mean, still, like, I searched the playlist Rush because I want to play Rush. 
And it put me in Team Deathmatch. That's like playing Call of Duty Go, searching fucking domination, and it puts you in, I don't know, hardcore kill confirmed. Like, it's like, what? So that is kind of annoying, but at least the game hasn't crashed on me yet. If I can make it to the end of this game without this game crashing, it would be better than it has been the past couple days. The past couple days it's just been unplayable. For me, at least. I don't know if it's affecting everybody, but it's doing it to me. And it's a shame, too, because I really, really like Battlefield. Like, I never played Battlefield before, but now that I'm playing it, I'm getting so into it. And also, Forza 5, if you guys have a next-gen console... And you guys like cars at all? Just anything at all about cars? Get Forza 5. It's amazing. I should have shot those faggots. Yeah, as you guys can tell, I'm a Battlefield noob. But the reason I use noob tubes is because, one, they're just overpowered. And two, if they're behind a wall, the noob tube just blows the wall up. <laughs> Which is sick. I destroyed equipment. I don't know why I did that, but it was fun. See, the triggers are so sensitive, I'm constantly accidentally shooting my gun. Like, the new Xbox One controllers are crazy sensitive. I have the feeling I'm about to run into a shitload of bad guys. We killed each other, that was gay. Boo. In case anybody's wondering what those medkits are, basically I'm throwing down a medkit for myself so I can regenerate my health. But also the enemies, or not the enemies, but my friendly teammates, they can, um, you know, re regenerate their health from that as well. That's kind of how Battlefield is. Unlike Call of Duty, where your health just automatically regenerates every time. It does not Battlefield 2 after a while, but your teammates can just throw down health packs, and it's pretty, pretty helpful. It, it also depends on what class you're running. I mean, some classes are just for ammo. Some classes are just to revive people. Some classes are for, uh, you know, med packs, like I just had it there. It's a pretty cool game, where everybody has, like, their own little responsibility. Oh, we killed each other. I fucked that dude up. He sucks. That's why you shouldn't snipe in Battlefield. <laughs> Well, if anybody's watching it till this point, we're at eight and a half minutes, I'd be surprised. Actually, not really, because honestly, Battlefield's pretty entertaining. I mean, I'm not doing good. If I was doing good, I'd probably, you know, be a lot better to watch, but... Yellow in it. Now, hopefully these graphics come out good for you guys. The last Battlefield game I... I um, uploaded the graphics and look as good as they do on the console, but that's probably because of my recording device and uploading it to YouTube and rendering it. I mean, obviously, it's not going to look as good, but if you guys can see my screen right now, you guys would love it. I mean, I'm playing on a $500 monitor, though, so obviously, it looks a lot better. I try to steal a guy's kill. I can't find nobody. Let's run around with a noob tube. There they are. Well, I have such a hard time killing people with guns in this game that I just 
I don't know. I prefer the noob tube. And like I said, that guy is hiding behind the wall over there. I can just blow the wall up and he'll just die. Uh, do you guys see him? Because I don't see him. I see him! I see him! Ah, he got me! Oh no, somebody else got me. God damn it. I don't know why he can't choose my deploy point. It's kind of gay. That's why I like playing Rush. In case anybody's wondering what's going on with the score, why it's going up, I don't know. <laughs> this is my first time ever playing this game type. I kind of wish Call of Duty had parachutes. Every time I jump off the building, I just pull my parachute. And I get no damage. Well, I mean, sometimes it hurts me a little bit, but for the most part, there's no damage, so it's pretty nice. And there's unlimited sprint. That's pretty given, because there's fucking huge maps. I can't find nobody. I can't even get five more kills. Apparently the whole battle is taking place up top. It kind of sucks. This game mode doesn't have any tanks or helicopters or shit. That's kind of what makes Battlefield more fun is all the tanks going around. You're ducking and weaving and dodging fucking artillery missiles. Alright, I have the feeling there's gonna be people right here. Two kills left. Come on, let's do this. God damn it. I suck dick. Alright, that's the end of this video, I guess. Um let's go say go ahead and see how bad I did real quick. Might as well, right? If you guys watch to this point, you deserve to laugh at me, so. I went 12 and 7. That's actually not bad for my first game on. And the game didn't crash, so I'm going to go enjoy some more Battlefield 4, guys. If you guys like these kind of videos, I can play this game more and get better at it, and I'll upload it more often. Let me know. But thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Have a nice night. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.